All right, so for the barbell RDL, we're gonna start with the barbell on the floor to get in position. And just like the dumbbell RDL, we're gonna start with a slight bend in the knees. And as we lower down, we're gonna push our hips back. We need to make sure that our hips actually travel back, that way we have a vertical shin position and we're not bent down just like this. It's not a squat, it's a hinge pattern. So we need to make sure our hips shift backwards. So in this position here, our elbows are gonna be flared out. We need to rotate them backwards to protect the back. <sighs> Here, toes are gonna to be pointed forward, slight bend in the knees, and we're gonna push our hips back and let that bar slide all the way down, and fire back up. Slide down, squeeze the butt. In that bottom position, you should still be able to squeeze your butt and your core to protect your spine. So you're here, I'm still squeezing, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Come back up. One mistake that people make in the bottom position is they come down one they lose this lat tension here so they end up rounding their back and the other thing is they come down here and then they continue to extend out and all that's doing is just loosening your lower back and making your back more vulnerable to injury so need to make sure we pretend our credit card is in our armpits and we're squeezing that we lower down tight we stay controlled and then fire back up and that's the barbell rdl